Hi everyone, Steph here. I hope you guys are having a great day. And I want to share with you a mini album that I made. It was very quick and it was inspired by spring. So um, I used the paper antique papery from color box that Janelle Craft Sponge gave me. Thank you so much, Janelle. And I used this in my last video. Told you guys that I was going to make a mini album. So here it is. And uh, this paper collection she gave me, she also sent the glitter sticker that I used as you can see that they did they used a few of them and the fabric sticker absolutely love these so thank you so much Janelle and um, also um, I use my cinch and I love it it was so easy to do I put some ribbon here some ribbons because we all love ribbon here is another um, embellishment piece that Janelle gave me it says hello sunshine the sunshine is a stamp image stamp from uh, Prima so um, I a personal challenge for me uh, this year is to use up my stamps now almost all the stamps that I use in this album came from Tere who is paper lover here on YouTube so thank you so much Tere um, so and also another challenge that I um, I did for myself was to try to keep this album flat so making flat embellishments for the pages so uh, this is uh, I believe six by six the covers are chipboard but the paper the sheets inside are just the cardstock which the cardstock which is double sided and I love it um, so that's the cover there and if you want to know anything about I don't want to go into too much details just ask me and I'll let you guys know okay so this is the inside it says a perfect day and I'm thinking that whoever gets this album can put their pictures of their garden or any um, springtime vacation whatever that they did so let me say that the pages the page full design was from Elsa she's uh, just a few design here on YouTube I will look for that video. It's an old video from her, but I'll look for it and I'll put it in the description box below if I could find it. But yeah, it's quite easy. You need double side paper and 12 by 12. Not a lot of measuring. Um, it folds so quickly and it goes by like that very fast. So um, I use some um, Spellbinders die, the flowers and the the um, leaves there. So Marcia Stewart punch and uh, Marcia Stewart stamp. I just stamp and fussy cut out and that's it. It says remember this. This is from the sticker. Um, backed it with a piece of cardstock that I turned into a fishtail. I did tags for each page and uh, this is where I use a lot of the stamps. Here um, I kept it quite plain and simple. Uh, tend to make it more muted in color and that's from this stamp set absolutely love it so thank you again Tere and nothing at the back so that goes in just like that and um, on the inside of that page I do not I did not do anything oops sorry um, so I let the paper speak for itself absolutely beautiful and this is the back side of that full page so this complete one page absolutely love it and here from that whole collection this sheet of paper is my fave absolutely love it um, this is part of it and I also cut it out it's a doily with the flowers so pretty and this is a prima doily die I cut cut it in half so there's piece here and the other piece on the back side here is another um, stamp image there now that is from this set that I did um, I put it together so I use this birdie, this branch, and this flower, and I just stamp it going down to create that image there. So pretty. And the inside of that page is totally blank, and that's the back side. So this is the other part of the Prima die. Again, um, what I also use in this album are stickers that Teddy gave me. I backed it on chipboard and use um, dimensional tape to pop it up um, and the chipboard gave it I mean the cereal box gave it that chipboard um, look and feel here is this next page this is a glitter 3d stickers again from Tere as is this and this here if you can see that beautiful 
flower cluster image is from this stamp set also again from Tere absolutely love these stamps Tere thank you so much um, and uh, the inside again plain the back side 3d stickers from Tere the butterfly and the sticker button I put it on chipboard um, so I fussy cut out this piece here from the paper line so pretty as this one here this is a spellbinders die as are these and I put if you could see some sea beads for the center of the flower another stamp image I showed you before and uh, this is the inside absolutely love that image there and here the bicycle um, is from the flip side of this page it says on the road again they are getting wrapped around I just cut it out and I put it right back um, in that spot so if you would lift this part of the paper you would see that I cut out the bicycle <laughs> um, here I use one of the fabric um, sticker from the collection as well as well of the sticker it says I like this EK success punch another flower stamp image there and the inside and that's the back side this is a 3d sticker of the birdie and I thought it went well with the stickers that said the perfect pair I thought it was so cute um, there's another tag and uh, hair swell binders die flower more seed beads Marta Stewart stamp that I cut out uh, MFT die and a little birdie from the uh, Sizzix and Hero Art stamp and die set I use them on the cover of this album as well that's the inside it says um, there's no place like home and that's the back side of that here a chipboard sticker that from that Teddy gave me so binder die this bird cage here's a Martha Stewart punch that um, does not punch off the page it doesn't punch it out just pop it up um, seed beads again and this is a Martha Stewart I think it's a daisy punch so uh, this bird here is um, another one from Tere and inside is plain and that's the back side absolutely love this page and this is the last page and it's a 3, 3D glitter sticker that Tere gave me um, and I stamp another flower cluster image there and that's the inside and this is the back so that's my spring inspired mini album and um, let me know what you think. I know some of you guys are still waiting for the snow to go away. <laughs> so I hope you get that, get your wishes. Um, and thanks so much for stopping by. Let me know what you think about the album. I appreciate all comments and subscribers. Have a great day. See you soon or talk to you soon with another video. Bye guys.